Hello everyone, we are back at Crystal Park um, and it, we just got everything loaded. We got it in our cart, we got it right there, keeping an eye on it. And it started pouring about the time that we were ready to leave the truck. So I'm actually glad we didn't get halfway up the hill before it started downpouring. Um, so we're just gonna wait out this uh, rain here, and uh, then we're gonna go up and see if we can find some crystals. We're really hoping to find an amethyst today, um, but we'll be happy with some smoky quartz or just regular quartz crystals too. Either way, we're gonna have a good time, so hope you enjoy. Well, it's still drizzling a little bit, but we're anxious and we're gonna go try it. So hopefully we don't get soaked. definitely tell that the air is thinner up here we ain't used to that and we're out of shape yeah. Well, I think we found the spot, so I'm gonna park in here. Somebody dug on the stump fairly deep. And uh, they even left some crystals. Well, they didn't want them. So, we're gonna look around here and we'll go from there. I am breaking down this wall so we're not tunneling. And as I'm doing it, I'm sifting throwing the big rocks out and sifting with my classifier through the small stuff and seeing what's in there and stuff the stuff I want to keep I'm throwing in the bucket and the bucket will go out and then I will just keep repeating the process and Kim's over there she's just digging by hand little by little she will probably not get wore out near as quickly as I will doing this. We shall see. Kim looked over and she says, I see one. In here. That wasn't even where we were digging. That's probably the best one of the day. Wow, nice and clear. Good job. Well, we're gonna try a different spot. We were literally digging here, not finding really anything. We found that one crystal. I think that was somebody just missed it or forgot it. But Kim was over there 
two and a half feet below the surface and found a Ziploc bag in hard pack dirt. So we are digging in someone else's backfill hole from years ago, apparently. So we're gonna go find another place. Found a new spot. Hopefully it's a good sign. I looked down and we're not even in the fresh gravel. It's just in somebody else's tailings or whatever. Look at that, even looks like a smoky piece. Or it's just dirty, just dirty. But there was one there. Let's see what else is here. It looks like we found possibly a good one. Look at that point. That's more like it. Nice big fatty. Kinda like myself. And another one breaking down this wall here so that we're not tunneling and just in breaking that down we're finding it. Piece. Another one? Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, I'm covered. <laughs> My leg is buried in about a foot of dirt. I need to get up and shovel this out, but I'm being lazy because I don't want to, but I know I need to. Dang it anyway. Probably can't see very well. It started pouring again, but here we are. Anyway, this is why you don't tunnel. You're sitting here, and this only overhung maybe about this much. Not even. Not even, and it just fell in. And uh, it's a piece of a crystal, but when it fell in, that I seen something. In here, see how little it is. A little, little piece. Look at that. So, is that another? Nope, oh, that's wood. So, anyway, be careful. So dirt doesn't fall on you and hurt you. We're gonna enjoy our time being soaking wet.
I think we're gonna be done for the day. We done dug till we tuckered ourselves out. And uh, we don't wanna quit because we know we won't be back till next year. And this is one of our, this has gotta be one of our favorite places to come. It's just so much fun to come here and find these crystals. It's a lot of work, obviously. You get just a tad bit dirty if you really go after it. If you come out here, I would highly recommend gloves, mosquito spray, which we actually didn't have to put on this time, but usually there's quite a bit, but gloves definitely. And uh, plenty to drink and digging tools and something to put your crystals in. Yeah, we almost filled a honey container up. So we'll go down, wash them off, and uh, show you what we got. Oh, we're back at the truck, and uh, here's all our treasures. All sorts of stuff. Got a couple decent sized ones, and these here actually have just a touch of amethyst in them. It's very faint, it's hard to see, but it is there. I don't know if you can see it on this camera, but we'll get a close-up of our favorite ones, including the amethyst ones, when we get them back home and get them all cleaned up properly. So, well, we had a great time here, and uh, if you ever get the chance, be sure to stop by Crystal Park in Montana and give it a try, because it's a lot of fun. Definitely worth it. Besides, how do you beat the scenery? Anyway, so... If you enjoyed this video, drop a like and a subscribe, leave a comment, and uh, not much else to say besides we hope to see you guys on the next one. people are. They're going after some wild mountain cows. They best be careful. They think they're going out and going to get a snack. They're going to be the snack. <laughs>